Alright, well, I might not be able to do a full world per video after this one, but I think I can at least handle this one so far. Maybe next, maybe like World 3 I'd have to cut in half from World 4. We'll see, we'll see, we'll see, we'll see. Up to level 3. I'm pretty sure I beat this game when I was a kid. I think so. Okay, this guy does not have polarity. Can't do anything with him. Elevator! The perspective here is all kinds of funky. I don't know how to get that one up because I didn't just bounce into it. Got a staircase going on. Eh, hop. What's this? So oh, they're falling. So that was all skill, no luck at all. This might be one. Okay, gotta catch it quick. Okay, these are on the falling platforms again. Got the one up! It was worth it! It wasn't worth it. Technically it was worth it in the I'm getting more money and not losing lives sense, but not worth it in the I want to just progress with this game sense. But this time I got it and can progress, so this time it was totes worth it. Totes. I should check the recording. I didn't. I forgot to look at what the par time was for that last level. I'm super curious. Because I know I took like six minutes. But. Oh, I almost didn't see it. The ID was right there. Uh, I can't catch it. I gotta swing back into it. Definitely want that. Got it. <laughs> that might be exactly why that one up is there. You launch yourself off, you die. Stay here. Oh, nope, you don't launch yourself off at all, you also die. You gotta find a balance. Look at this game, making you strike a balance. No, I'm not good at balancing X. Luckily, they had the foresight to put a one up right there. So I can try it as many times as I would like, which apparently I need. So this game is not hard in the sense that there are plenty of lives, I'm probably not going to get a game over, but it is hard in the sense that I keep dying. A lot. And sometimes I just don't jump, sometimes my response time is just abysmal. And I say my response time because it was my response time, it was not the game just lagging or something, I can't make excuses like that, that would be a disingenuous. At least I'm starting to get that. Starting to know when to launch myself off there. Alright. Grab this. Miss that. This is just... Why does it even bother going back down? I think that's just for that pinky mail there. Also, let me skip this. Okay, that needs blue. Just don't want to screw up, man. This, I don't know where I'm going. Okay, I'm going over there. Grab this, grab this. Do I want to bounce off or drop off? I want to drop off. This just keeps going. And I couldn't see above the clouds, so I just got lucky that I picked the right color. Oh jeez, staircase all the way over here, it's gonna go down before I make it. Yep. And of course this one has to be switched over here, so gotta go all the way back. And run straight off the edge, because I am not good at this game. But hey, that worked out well enough. I can go a little bit faster now that I know it's coming. Alright, let's not screw this part up. <laughs> That's exactly how you do screw this part up, not 
It's the opposite of what I said. Okay. Well, maybe I could catch... No, can't catch anything. Oh boy, this is uh, gonna make for a really entertaining video, guys. Me just walking back and forth, flipping the same switch over and over. Made it, made it, made it, made it, made it. And that's the exit. Alright, four and a half minutes. What's the part time here? One and a half. I was only three minutes over, that's nothing. I only, what, like, tripled the time. Yeah. Details, details. I'm super good at this game. Good, same one. That's what I was kind of hoping for. Not the most entertaining LP-wise, but definitely the best for giving me a shot at redemption. All right, let's not screw this part up right here. Why did it not grab? You saw that that was red, right? Okay, now I don't hope I get this one again. I don't. I don't. I hope that I never see that one again for as long as I live. Which is a reasonable chance. What are the odds that I got the same one four times in a row? Unless that's the only one in World 2, but I doubt that. There's got to be at least three, right? Why would they? Why would they only make one? And then put in the feature of making it random. All right, level four. Already a pinky metal that I'm going to ignore. These don't fall, I'm a little surprised. I thought they were just gonna be falling all over the place. I'm gonna be falling all over the place. The blocks are not, apparently. I'm going all slow and steady, and then I still fall. Welp. Death is funny, right? That's the mark of a good LP is when you just walk straight off ledges, right? And totally doing it on purpose for entertainment. Totally. I'm the best at this. Jump over here. Be red. Drop off. Blue. Drop off. Jump. Okay, I guess I gotta run a little bit. Fine. The running is so awkward. Uh, this isn't going well. This isn't going well at all. It's been almost a minute and I've barely progressed past the very beginning of the level. Oh boy. Lives aren't going to be an issue, I say. Lives aren't going to be an issue. We'll see if that... Oh! I see an extra life. It's just a little bit past where I'm at. Where I keep running straight off the edge. Oh boy. Red, drop. Blue, drop. Ja! Alright. Not the right color. I am gonna wait in this full loop because there is a one up over there and I want it. And yes, then I'm gonna go on this thicker path because it is thicker. Pinky medals are not worth the danger. I haven't gotten a checkpoint yet, so if I die, I have to start all over. This camera's not really doing me any favors. There we go. There's the falling platforms. And here's my checkpoint. Red. Okay, I gotta make it there real quick. Wrong color. It's not that hard to make it though. To the the, the the time limit there is not as strict as I was afraid of. So let's do the correct color this time. Grab this. Fly over here. Miss the one up, but that's okay. Bounce off of this. Grab this. Fall here. What's this? It's a staircase. See, totally a staircase. Why is jumping so hard? I was jumping, but running forward to the second. So this I want to get rid of. That guy killed me last time through shenanigans. This is a little bit confusing. Not that confusing. I'm just so afraid. Everything. Trying to hit this guy with that other eye, but didn't work out. Doesn't matter. 
This pinky metal I will get because I actually think it's a little safer than that. And oh boy. I should have. I know how I should. Oh boy. Blue, then. Yeah, then blue to connect to it. Oh, I didn't realize I would jump off like that. Okay, then don't do that. Bad strats. Bad strats. Alright. Leap over this guy. I'm faster than them, or rather my platform is. So, all is well. These are going to try and push me off. I'm not going to let them. Here's a switch I can flip. Okay, and that opens the door. I'm going to wait for it to close. Then try running across without getting pushed off. Not so bad. Oh, come on, come on. Okay, good. Knock that guy off. Grab this one up. And we've seen this before. Watch above them. Head over to nowhere. Nowhere in particular. Don't get the checkpoint, because checkpoints are overrated. Why would you want to get a checkpoint? It's more important to just kill yourself. Just launch yourself off the edge of everything. The edge of life. You don't have to catch yourself on that. It carries... When you bounce yourself, you maintain your momentum well enough that you're fine. Okay, not so bad. That nearly killed me. Get this one up again, but then I'm going on the platform on the other side. Taking it nice and safe. Jesus. Take it nice and safe and then almost kill yourself in the process. Alright. Red. I kind of want to do that at the last second possible. Where... The idea is right there for my bonus game. Oh, and the switch is already all the way up there, so I gotta go back down anyway for the switch. Alright. Come on. Yeah, made it up. Okay, here we got some bullets being fired. Not sure if those push you off or just outright kill you. This looks like... How do I get past this? Just jump, just jump, just jump, just jump. And we made it! We made it to the boss. It's probably a cutscene. 5 minutes, 41 seconds. <laughs> Goals a minute 50. Whew! Wow. Uh, I wasn't expecting this game to actually get difficult. <laughs> like, at all. I thought that, like... Up till the end, it would be pretty simple. Playing the same one again. What are the odds? What are the odds? I have no idea what the odds are, because I have no idea how many there are, but I'm pretty confident that the odds aren't just one. Let's do it correctly this time. This is my final shot at redemption. What? I really don't get it. Well. Let's see a cutscene. Let's listen to some sort of expedition talks or something. That's what happened last time. Love and hate. Did I ever tell you the story of what happened to me when I was a young aspiring villain? No. One day I was walking past the toy store when I caught a glimpse of a brilliantly colored cube toy and a stuffed bear. My ingenious mind instantly drew an image of the cube and bear combined into one magnificently evil creation. Hmm. I had just pressed my face up against the stone window, drooling in excitement at the thought of creating such a delightfully wicked creature from simple toys, when the oafish store owner suddenly appeared. Without warning, he pushed me to the ground and ordered me to remove myself from the property. But I had my revenge. In a strange twist of fate, he became the first victim to face the terrifying creature that I devised. Clearly, the fool did not know who he was dealing with. What are you mumbling about? He's mumbling about the next boss, Pinky. Come on, pay attention. You need to focus here. We're going to be fighting a bear in some colorful blocks. So, a bear. We're going to be fighting a bear. Alright. And this is going to be it for World 2. Let's fight ourselves a bear, and hopefully not get our face blown up. 
the first boss is any indication, he'll drop a bunch of lives when he's dead, so that'll be nice. Once again, it looks like the first attempt's gonna be the easiest, but I will probably die because I have no idea what to expect, what patterns or anything. The field looks a bit bigger than it did before. Well, okay, maybe not. That is not a bear. I do see colorful blocks. It's following me, it's trying to slam its hand down on me, and I wasted an opportunity there. I think. And back in hand form. I was wondering if it was going to do something different. Apparently not. Okay, not so hard. Let's just keep missing though. That way I'll never kill it. Is this the only pattern? Just hand? Maybe when I hit it, we'll do a different pattern. Just run around in circles. This is really not hard at all. But I. Okay, I can hit it in its little cube form. Probably cannot hit it in hand form, right? Yeah. Worth an experiment. That was a waste of a pill, because I already had my pill. But if the pattern doesn't change, then I might be fine. Even though I can't seem to hit him for the life of me. So far, if the pattern doesn't change, this is like way easier than the plant boss, at least in terms of survivability. It's harder to hit, smaller target, but okay, things are changing now. It's legs now instead of a hand. It's gonna leap. Oh, shockwaves, probably those will hit me. They did, indeed. And the monster killed me. I wonder how many more hits it had. Maybe just the one? Because the last boss had three hits, but since we just got to a new form, I'm gonna expect maybe not. I'm thinking it has three uh, forms. That was silly, Neo. That one I blame you on. That one was not my fault. I was totally facing the cube. I'm not trying to get two hits in at once. I don't think I can. Once I hit it, it turns back into a hand. And I don't think you can hold on to cubes for that long. So I don't think you can get two hits at once. Plus it's a lot safer to just try to hit it with the second cube. Alright, now we got legs. Wait for it to leap. Jump over a shockwave. Get hit by an enemy, but hit him. He's not dead, indeed. This will actually be easier to see the shockwaves, though, I think, so... Ouch, get hit by an enemy. And is it dead? Yeah, that's what I thought. There'd be one more form. Oh boy. Okay. Maybe I take back what I said about this being easier than Plant Boss. The hand part is. The hand part is definitely easier than the Plant Boss. But unfortunately. The hand part is not the only part. There are at least three parts. Probably, I'm guessing, exactly three. Alright, onto legs. I want to go somewhere at an angle so I can see the shockwaves better. Jump, jump. Oh, fuck. Oh, I ruined that. Over here. Jump at me, bro. Legs aren't too hard once you learn them, and he gives you plenty of time to hit him. You're facing the wrong way, bro. There you go. Alright, and now on to the cube. The big cube. Okay, is that it? Hey, well, is it? And let's not hit it so that I have to survive that one additional time. And run off the edge, because that's how you dodge a cube. Hey, boy. 
It's gonna be a long recording, guys. But I think I think I'm gonna win this time. I can handle this guy. I can handle this guy. He's not so tough. He thinks he's tough, but he's not so tough. And that should be it for hams. On to legs. I still haven't seen the bear, so I'm wondering if that comes up at any point. Alright, one more hit on legs. And then on to cube. This guy's really not bad once you learn him. Not bad at all. Gotta get in close to make sure I don't miss, because I don't want to have to fight this guy for any longer than I already have to. Alright, one more hit, I believe. And I got hit both times he attacked me, so hopefully this is it. Hopefully he's completely dead. Yeah, it looks like he is. I just don't want to get too close. And yeah, I think I got even more lives than I did against... Oh boy, do I have to kill him again? No. <laughs> Alright guys, one more cutscene, then I'll see you next time. <laughs> Jesus hell. Alright. To the cowboy world! Let's see what happens. See how pissed off Pinky is about the fact that I still have done nothing to her. No cutscene. No cutscene at all. Okay, that's not what I expected. Well, it's been real. This game is definitely getting harder, so maybe I won't play all of World 3 in one sitting. We'll see. Regardless, I will see you guys next time. Bye!